Um, I, I will when I see them online. Uh, but they're not even online? Um, and the one I remember is that... Give me a second, give me a second, give me a second. Okay, yeah. I have a lobby ready. Finn! Finn! Finn. Oh, wait, one second. That's the one. Okay, yeah, 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 yeah. Yep, yep. All right, testing, testing. Looks like we're good. Awesome. What's up, everybody? Let me move this mic over a little bit. Or this way. There we go. Awesome. Cool. Oh, hold on. Let me join that group real quick. Cool. All right. Hey, everybody. Welcome to another Long Branch Green OV Sports match. We are in week four of the Overwatch series. Uh... Long Branch going to be playing Matawan High School today. And if you check out some of our uh, updated graphics, Long Branch is 1-2 and two. last week. A very, very close matchup against Manchester. I'm going to post that. I think it's still posted on Twitch. I'm going to post it on the YouTube. But a very close, very awesome match. Highly recommend going to check it out. Um, and going up against Matawan, who is currently 3-0. and zero, So they are undefeated in the series so far. So... This could be a really big game for Long Branch to win, and maybe try to swing back the uh, swing back the series. Maybe even, uh, especially if I think if Long Branch is able to kind of like turn it around and go undefeated the rest of the season, I think a playoff appearance is definitely possible. All right. Um, just waiting on Madawan. They're running just a few minutes late. Just waiting on one player. No issues. We're usually starting just a few minutes behind. Twitch is down. Oh, yeah. It's been like that. Um, though I was able to get into the stream and update the information. And it does show that we are technically on. So, hopefully, it's all right. I, can't, I cannot control Twitch like that. I don't worry about. It. I I I think I see because uh, I have it. I have the uh, the stream browser open. And it looks like we're going. Okay. Uh, if people can't tune in, unfortunate. But we'll post the the match on YouTube anyway. Um. Yeah. So best of three. Just wait. You know, Matt. I want to join. On the side. All right, cool. Looks like we're getting those invites coming through. We'll go ahead and do a quick uh, roll call on the side of the Long Branch Green Wave today. We got September, who's going to be playing in the tank role. Reaper, 7812, who's going to be on the support role. Gelcraft on the DPS role. Mob Squad, or Mob Squid, in the DPS role. And Davi Ball on the support role. And it looks like we are getting... Looks like we are getting um, Madawan's players in right now. So, just a few minutes. I'll flip the screen over, or the, I'll flip the game over to the big screen as soon as uh, as soon as the, the game starts to boot up. Oh. 
I also do have control of chat, so if anyone is watching, feel free to chat. I will be able to chat back. <laughs> yeah, I don't know what's up with that. Switch might be having some technical issues. All right, so it looks like we got most of Matter One players. We got Minor, Minor, Coniner, Minor Coniner. CX thirty six, Yutatogashi, Fatal, and uh, just waiting on player number five. Long Branch is going to be the home team for this matchup, so they are going to be getting the first map pick. And I believe for for the control map, I believe they are going to be picking Lijiang Tower, so that should be a good one. Did did the Chinese New, New Year start near the Dragon? Or is that closer to February? Closer to February, closer to February okay. Because I know they have a the New Year, Lunar New Year, Lijiang Tower map with all the fireworks and stuff. That might be a cool. Awesome. And there is Mercy, player number five from Matawan. Looks like we got everyone in the lobby. And yeah, should be starting up momentarily. Ah, we should be fine. Okay, we are just waiting for the ready up from both Long Branch and Man or Matawan, and we'll get this match started. All right, looks like that's ready up from uh, from Matawan. I think we're about to get started. Okay, looks like we're just about to get started off. Let's switch it over to the big screen and let's get this game underway. Alright, map number one going to Li Zhong Tower. So, uh, previously, Long Branch has scrimmed against Matawan a couple of times this season already. Scrims just kind of like exhibition little like practice matches or whatnot. And I believe the record is one branch two, Matawan one. So like I said, they scrimmed a few times. So both these teams have a little bit of experience playing against one another. So I think that this is definitely going to be uh, an interesting little matchup. Now that the uh, now that their match actually has some stake and standings uh, for the uh, for the yeah. winner, uh, for the winter series, so, so this will definitely be oh, a good one to watch. Awesome. Let's go ahead and just check out the scoreboard real quick. All right. Do a quick camera check. It looks like we're ready to go. Awesome. Both teams are going to be battling for who can bring up the capture point up to 100% first. 
looks like. Long branch right now. Ooh, looks like they're gonna be running the Maga. Maga actually getting a little, little nerf. So, ooh, they also have a fashion. They're gonna have three miniguns on their side. Ooh, here comes the... That's gonna be a anti-nade on to September. Oh, going a little dangerously low. Oh, he's gonna be carried up by his team. Looks like they're gonna be... Kevin gonna be going to try and cut this Maga off. Maga going to one. Awesome. Oh, it's like Reaper trying to keep his team up as much as he can. The Zuzu coming in. He's going to be keeping up Mob Squid. And Gelcraft's going to be getting the double kill. He's going to be keeping everyone in. Mercy's going to get the res on Tamaga, but he is by himself. He's not going to be able to stay there in that fight, especially against all five of Long Branch's players. And ooh, the rail shot just narrowly missing that second support. Looks like September. Getting a little aggressive here, especially... Nate's coming through, some players going low. Mauga's coming in. Cardiac Overdrive's activated. Fatal is going to be getting the pick. It looks like Madawan is going to come back and clean up the Long Branch team. Looks like some of Long Branch's players might have made it. Looks like they're trying to get out of here. Oh my god, Mog is cutting off Moth Squid from the rest of his team. He's going to wall to keep himself up. He's going to ice himself. That Mauga might, might be by himself. The, 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 the ice block is going to keep Mauga in. They might be able to trap him, maybe get a pick. Oh, unfortunate. Not going to find him. Not going to find it. Mob Squid a little bit low. He's looking for a support. support. Freeze is up. Well, it's like, unfortunately, September are going to be getting eliminated by the rest of the team. Magus one, Magus one, Magus one, and he is gone. Now it is an even matchup. Both tanks are down. The overclock coming through with the sleep. Going to be catching Reaper. It, the Bastion from Madawan going to come through. Going to put Long Branch on the back foot in this team fight. Uh, looking at the capture progress, Madawan uh, working their way past 40%. Bastion ultimate's coming in. See if he finds anything. Oh. No, I'm not going to find anything. Long Branch is going uh, to escape past that ultimate. Madawan now approaching 50% mark. Long Branch with 26%. Looks like Madawan going to be retaliating with their... Oh, unfortunately, the Overclock is going to catch September. Long Branch going to be down their tank. And the Mercy is going to resurrect the Odagachi. And Malga is going to be getting damage boosted. Long Branch does not have the numbers. And I'd say off that, they are now going to be down. They're going to have to look for the regroup. Looks like Madawan is finding a lot of key picks, a lot of key eliminations. Rampage gonna be coming through. That's gonna cut off all healing for anyone who gets hit. They're gonna find Mauga, so that's gonna be the tank. The pretty much uh, the, all the staying power gonna be gone. Long Branch, good Rampage coming in from September is going to. Looks like they're gonna be finding. See how many late picks they get. That's gonna be the support lineup. Long Branch gonna have a little bit of an opportunity here to get some progress on the board. Reaper gonna be finding a solid kill onto, onto the enemy Sojourn. These picks, or, or some of these late picks, are gonna kind of like stagger Madawan, kind of like coming back to like a kind of like a full force to kind of like come back against Long Branch. But those stagger picks are gonna allow Long Branch to get some capture progress. Madawan at 92%. They are going to be looking for one fight here. Ooh, that's gonna be a big freeze, hopefully. Dobby Ball. The cage fight is gonna be coming in from Mauga. They're gonna need to try and kill this Mauga as quick as possible. And the damage was gonna be coming through. Looks like they're gonna be flipping over the capture progress. I think this is gonna be a last chance contest for Long Branch right here. The progress, the Katsuni rush coming in. He's gonna need the touch. And he touches! He goes down, but he gave the team the opportunity to maybe find maybe find a comeback here. Oh, unfortunately, September tank is gonna be going down. The overclock gonna be coming in from Gelcraft. Oh, he's gonna get a pick onto the Mercy. Long Branch, uh, the, the beat coming from Dobby Ball. Long Branch trying to hold on to the point. They have two full health people. Dobby Ball speed of pass as fast as he can. The freeze. Bob Squid trying to put Madawan on ice. Long Branch is going to be able to come back. September's gonna find a kill. September dangerously low. He needs a big carnage here. Long Branch is fighting for this. 
Rampage, or Reaper, trying to keep his teammates up with the Zuzu. He's trying to pump his heels into September, trying to keep that tank alive. The Mercy flying around is a huge annoyance in a game of Overwatch. They need to shut this Mercy down. He's so low, he's one shot. Oh no, Maga's gonna get the stomp on to Davi Ball, one branch, now down three people. The freeze is gonna come through, this needs to be big. Oh no, the Bastion is going to get res. Wow, what a close matchup right there. Madawang gonna be taking the first point. Long Branch doing all they can there to see if they can like take the point, just going back and forth. Mercy popping the Valkyrie and staying in that fight and keeping Maga up. Saved them there. Yeah, I'd say that, that definitely was a good effort on the side of Long Branch for like being able to get to, to, to kind of like go down to only two people like against like four like a, or like a whole team and like the rest of Long Branch's team being able to get there and contest is definitely commendable though the fight is not going to swing in their favor. Got a quick look at the scoreboard. All right, we're going back into the action. Looks like they're gonna be. Madawan's gonna be going over to the Rhine comp. Still have the Bastion and the Sojourn. Bastion taking that wide angle. Oh, wow, September using his knife to keep the Reinhardt at bay with his charge. September gonna see if he can peel his teammates over there. Carnage is going to go up. Mob Squid getting a solid uh, cluster rocket, or Helix rocket. That's going to be Madawan's tank as well. Madawan does have the point, but this is going to be a quick cleanup for Bomb Branch to, to take the, uh, to uh, swing the point in their favor. You see Mob Squid switching on over to the Soldier for, I guess, like more dedicated hit scan presence to, 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 uh, to counter that Mercy, or to at least put some more pressure on her. And Long Branch is going to pass Madawan to capture progress. My heart going in. Looks like Katsuni Rush going in. And it looks like Madawan going to be getting some good value out of that Katsuni Rush. And Long Branch is going to reset after that. Let's get a quick look at the ult. Looks like Long Branch Reaper trying to throw in the Katsuni Rush there. See if he's going to be able to swing it. Unfortunately, not going to find the value that he was looking for. Long Branch, Temper has his Rampage ready. And uh, three Long Branch's uh, team members are going to have their ult uh, slowly coming online as well. Branch looking for an opening. The Rampage gonna come in, he's going to find two. Oh, with the, the Zuzu gonna come through. And then the Shatter, the Retaliating Shatter. That's gonna be a solid play right there from Madawan. The Rampage would have been like, like would have been good there, but let's see. Uh, Miner, Co-Niner with that Zuzu. Oh wow, Yadagashi from Madawango again. A solid railgun shot right there. I'm gonna stagger Long Branch's push a little bit more. Capture progress gonna be creeping up for Madawang. That's that's going to be another rail shot coming in for Madawang. Long Branch gonna have to wait just a little bit longer to get a solid attack push right here. Looks like the beat, Long Branch gonna be opting to run all the way around the point. The Zuzu gonna keep them alive for that Bastion ult. Mob Squid gonna find a kill. Looks like there's only a couple people left on point. Support and a DPS. There's only one right now. The point 
capture Mad One all the way up to 99%. Oh no, he's only one. The Reaper gonna be going down Dobby Wall. Last line of defense as the rest of Long Branch's team try to trickle into touch. Not gonna be enough. Mad One gonna be taking Lijong Tower 2-0. Let's go ahead and get a look at the uh, play of the game. Going to be going to CX36. Reinhardt. Wow, that's a big pin right there for him. Just the bind with that Katsuni rush. With the extra extra swing speed for Reinhardt. He's going to find cleanup. That first map looked pretty good for Wombrae. Second one, little little shaky. With um, a lot of a lot of pressure, especially since the mercy is going to be able to. Uh, oh, let me flip on over. Especially with um, ew, random spam in the chat. Um. Anyway. Um. Yeah. Like the the mercy with. With the, the heal and damage boost combined with, as you saw on the side of Madawan, uh, Yutadagashi, uh, um, especially combined with Sojourn's, uh, Sojourn's rail gun can be like absolutely devastating. I'm pretty sure, like with full charged rail with damage boost, like you're gonna one shot like 90% of the characters in this game. Definitely a good combination, and especially with like the Bastion as well, providing like just a ton. Of like of uh, pressure with uh with the uh, turret form. Long bridge uh, the long bridge does is is like finding like picks and like openings and stuff. It's just that like especially there like on uh, on the second point on uh on night market they were just like Yadagashi was just finding those rail shots and they just buffed sojourn. Why? I don't know. I don't work for Blizzard, but little uh take a little bit of a wild pick right there or a wild change right there well, let me go ahead and update the scores Madawan taking the first map it's now match point for Madawan one more to go for the win uh Long Branch going to be selecting King's Row as the second map for their escort um I did not see which sides they picked we'll have to see Started. And looks like Wombrach could be playing on defense first. Switch on over to the big screen. So, Bastion, how are you settling in? Anything you need? Why seek answers when we do know the question? Yeah. Uh, sounds good. Right. King's Row, the debatable best map in Overwatch. My colleagues give me everything I need. Excuse me. Wait, I brought my coffee here. Where my coffee go? Oh no. Oh no. I might have. I made a point to remember. Awesome. And we're gonna be starting. One branch on the defense. Gonna be running a bit of a poke composition. September on the Sigma, and Mosquay going on to the Bash. And looks like Madawan is going for a Brawl style composition. Gelcraft going to be getting a solid rail shot. Going to be taken out the enemy Junkrat. Oh, looks like he might have a free shot on that Mercy. Mercy is absolutely crazy. Someone has to keep you alive. And we can see Reaper taking this very high up defensive position. He's going to be able to pump as much support into his team as he can without putting himself in a compromising position. He's out here, Gelcraft going on the flank, finding the off angle, and he's going to get the headshot on Miner Co. Niner. And September going to be following up. Bastion going to be down. Going to be taken out. CX36, that is going to be the end of the push for Madawan. Long Branch starting off with a pretty solid defensive hold here on King's Row. Looks like Mercy Ult's gonna be coming in. I think they're gonna be trying to let Mercy go in a 
throwing Battle Mercy. He's gonna try and get aggressive here. He's gonna try and find an elim. Oh, Ryan is eliminated. Oh, the, the Mob Squid is gonna be getting picked on the side of Long Branch, though. The Red is gonna be coming through. Oh no, Long Branch might not be able to. They're gonna need to shut down or get a pick right now. Force the Gelcraft gonna be go down. The Nano Boost coming in. September fighting for it. Oh, it's, he does not have his Accretion cooldown. It looks like Madawan gonna be forcing themselves into this point, and they're gonna be finding a lot of picks on the Wombridge. Looks like Wombridge is gonna have to back off of this point. Madawan gonna be taking point A, and gonna be getting their the, gonna be getting their payload on the road. Answer remains my objective lost. You stop the payload. That was actually kind of wild. I think I think Mercy went for a battle Mercy play. Reinhardt got it. Oh, looks like Reinhardt coming in from the back line. Going to be finding a pin. Wombridge could be down four to five now. So Temper is going to be trying to find a graphitic flux. Reinhardt's dead. Oh, the Bastion Ult's going to be coming down. That's going to be two. Uh, I think Wombridge is going to be able to hold on this favorable choke point, especially for a poke composition. And Mercy forced all the way to the back, not going to be able to find a res onto a, a, a fight swinging character like their like their Reinhardt. Though Reinhardt with the charge would come back fairly quickly. Oh, CX36 is going to be getting aggressive here. And going to get onto Gelcraft. And it looks like Miner come Niner going to be getting a good pick. And then C36 with the Shatter. Going to be getting a Snowball here on the Long Branch. Looks like Long Branch is going to have a good hold there, but. Looks like a little bit of. Uh, of a, a little bit of an awkward positioning is gonna allow Madawan to get their payload back moving. They're gonna be getting some progress. They're gonna be getting through, I think there's at least two or three strong choke, two, two strong kind of like choke corners that this payload is gonna be able to, to uh, navigate around or circumvent, whatever. I don't have, I don't, I don't, I don't need no fancy vocabulary. This ends now. Looks like. The Sojourn overclock gonna be getting committed. I wonder if it's gonna be too much pressure for Wombranch to contest. I think September's gonna try to muscle his way in. Fashion Hole gonna be coming in. He's gonna be nuking the point. I'm gonna be clear in Wombranch. Madawan coasting through checkpoint B. Four minutes left on their attack run clock. And they're gonna try to take checkpoint C. Oh, Mob Squid is going to try. Oh, looks like Mob Squid is going to uh, exchange with the enemy tank. This might be favorable for Long Branch. Kreesh coming through. Unfortunately, Fatal will be fine. Oh, Reinhardt is already back with his charge. And the damage boost to Bastion is going to do all the damage he can to tear up Long Branch's back line. It looks like the bad one is going to be all. Over it's going to be forward. Going to be trying to complete this point. Overclock trying to come in combined with the bat window. He's going to find a pick, but I do not think it is going to be enough. September going to be trying to use his graphitic flux to get as much damage on the point. Reinhardt is so low. Oh, unfortunately, the kinetic grasp is not going to be able to complete its cycle, so the so temper's not going to be getting the extra health. They're trying to jump and scramble on the point and do all that they can, but Madawan is going to complete their attack run with 2 minutes and 48 seconds on the clock. Not over till it's over. I'd say Long Branch definitely had some, some some like good engagements right there, but ultimately Madawan is going to find All right, we're gonna be swapping sides. Long Branch now gonna be going into their Attack run. If I'm not mistaken, when they played Manchester last week, both teams had a solid like attack push. So Long Branch could have an opportunity here to match 
their time or at least get some time in the bank so that both teams can can uh, opt for an attack Physical push or emotional <laughs> if you can handle both one branch definitely needs to play the long game here because they are they are, they are absolutely going to have to complete this map with some time or they risk fighting exclusively for a draw which might not be the best position to be in right now oh gonna be using the rush gonna be fine and he wants the bastion Demi tank is also low i think this is exactly what long branch is what long branch needs right now they need to steam roll as much as possible they're gonna find the bastion unfortunately reaper's gonna be going down oh looks like reinhardt is going to be getting red September is up though. He's gonna be able to do as much damage as he can to put Reinhardt on the back foot. He's gonna put up all the damage with that scattergun shotgun. Gonna be using Carnage, gonna land, gonna be getting some bleed damage for himself. Unfortunately, Wombridge needs to get some big picks here. They need to stabilize and they are going to find that. Looks like all, the only thing left is the support line. Looks like Battle wants to turn over to a Reaper pick. I think they switched off of the Bastion, yes they did. Wombranch is going to get a very, a very commanding first capture for a, for point A. You kind of saw there in that fight, they got the Bastion low, and then September using Junker Queen's rush to get some health and speed boost for him and the rest of his team, kind of going on to him to see if they can get much pressure, or, or to, to apply as much pressure as they can. The Rampage is going to come through. Unfortunately, he's going to get picked. Hopefully, maybe one bridge. I don't think I don't think there was much value out of that Rampage. I think that they were able to get... Oh, and then C36 is going to be coming back in with... With Pin. And it looks like... Uh, Oh, it looks like you got a guy. She's gonna be coming in the reaper. Gonna be going on the flank. He wants to, trying to find as many picks as he can. On. It looks like uh, Madawan gonna be pushing Long Branch into their spawn. Long Branch gonna be looking to regroup. Let's see. Disrupting. Looks like uh, Bastion Ult going to be coming in. Mavs going to be dropping. Oh, looks like uh, C36 going for the Reinhardt Shatter. Uh, he's going to be missing it. Oh, the Mercy's going to go in in the res. And now there is a Reinhardt loose in the back line. September is, or uh, Long Branch is going to find it. Oh, looks like Yadagashi was going to try and use the Reaper ult. Try to see if he could save that team fight, but he's going, and hopefully he's going to get picked. The Davi Ball with the Lucio going to be using... Using the beat to keep the team in the fight. Long Branch, three minutes on the clock. They need to get that payload moving. Looks like they're going to get the stagger pick onto Minor Co Niner. That's going to be a 10 second, 10 second respawn time for him to regroup with the rest of his team. Long Branch trying to get as many people on the cart as possible. They're trying to get as much with people as they need. Mob Squid using that sentry form, trying to see if he can find an elimination. They did bring out the Farah. Mob Squid is going to find the Reinhardt. That is exactly what they needed. Oh, Mercy gets the res through the wall. I think that's kind of silly, but, you know, it is what it is. And unfortunately, Madawan is going to bringing C30, CX36 back into the fight. They're going to be able to swing that with the staying power of Reinhardt being in the middle of the enemy team or in the middle of the Long Branch team. Looks like the overclock is going to be coming in from Long Branch or uh, Madawan. Gelcraft holding on to his. 
Hopefully they can find an opportunity. Ooh, Moscow's gonna get a pick. Oh, the pin! C36, I don't even know where he came from. I think he went up and around. Right now, uh, Madawan's defensive line is holding this, this, this second checkpoint. Long Branch, looks like they're gonna have all their ultimates online. They might try to dump all of them, see if, see if it's gonna be enough. Oh, two get hit, though he's gonna be caught out of position, so Temper gonna be going in with the Rampage. He's gonna find one, two. Moth Squid gonna be picking up number three. That's exactly what Long Branch needed. Uh, They're gonna be cruising, to, hopefully cruising to a successful second point capture, and they only used one ultimate for that fight. Looks like C36 is gonna try and contest as much as they can. Mercy was lurking there. September go try and take an aggressive position, try to hold him. Bastional coming in. Oh, looks like uh, looks like Madawan gave up that point. The enemy Reinhardt is pink from the anti the anti nade. Long Branch with a minute and fifty right now on their attack progress. They need to try and close this match up as fast as possible. Mob Squid taking the open corner, laying in the damage into the Madawan team. That Reinhardt is so close to being destroyed and they find it. Baptiste is going to be nano boosted. That's a lot of damage and a lot of healing. That's going to be a solid uh, Bastion Bomb from Mob Squid. He's going to be bringing in. He's absolutely landing, sniping those, those bomb shots. Reinhardt getting slept, getting carnage. It looks like that Long Branch is going to complete with at least a minute on the clock. And I believe that is, I think that's exactly what happened when they played Manchester last week. Manchester was able to get a decent, a, a decent time on the board. I think actually, I think it was the same. It was about two minutes and 50 seconds and Long Branch had about a minute. And then Long Branch got a solid win to steamroll and go through and go through the second checkpoint. This might be a repeat of last week and exactly what Long Branch needs. Whew. Uh, Long, since Long Branch completed with less time, they are going to be doing their attack run first with a minute and f with a minute and five seconds. Now, since Long Branch only has minute, like approximately a minute on their second attack push, it's going to be like absolutely crucial that they that they take their fights smart, because if the clock gets down to like 20 seconds and they make a mistake and lose like one or two players, it that might be the end. They might not be able to like recontest. So their engagements, their their first engagement here is going to be absolutely crucial. I think uh, September and Gelcraft are doing a pretty good job of like laying in, laying in like damage and getting their ultimates as quickly as possible. So hopefully, maybe we can get a, a quick rampage or overclock out of September. And it looks like they're gonna be swiped us uh, hopping off of the Reinhardt in favor of the Ramatra. Gelcraft finds the pick. Unfortunately, Mob Squid's gonna be going down. They're gonna need to watch that Mercy Res. Oh, looks like September wants to get aggressive. He wants... The res comes through, but the support line is going to keep the Bastion up. I think September is going to try and get aggressive to maybe try and get a kill. And six Long Branch is on the defensive side. They might be able to contest, hopefully. Take the Bastion, lay it in the damage. He's gonna find another pick though. I don't know if Long Branch is gonna have the power, is gonna have the, the, the power that they need to touch the point. And Madawan is going to have 
a clean hold on uh for Bombridge's second attack push. Kind of like what I said before, like when you only have like a minute left on the clock, if your team is the one that's getting picked off first, you're gonna it's you're not gonna be able to have the power. You're not gonna be able to have the manpower to force yourself onto the point. And unfortunately, that is what happened. Long Branch is going to be battling for a draw now. Madawan going to have 2 minutes and 48 seconds to attack. And typically a Overwatch capture point on an escort has 3 ticks or kind of like 3 checkpoints in kind of like their capture progress. Since Long Branch was not able to touch the point or capture anything, Madawan only needs 30%, 33%, or one-third of the capture progress to win, and Long Branch needs to hold that to force the draw. If Long Branch does force the draw, Long Branch still needs to get two map wins, so essentially the draw just kind of throws the match out, so, so this can potentially go long, but even longer if Long Branch is able to return. Turn to form. Oh, looks like the. Oh, looks like there's a little bit of a gap in the wall. Combined with the Bastion, able to blow through it. Oh, fortunately, Mossquid is going to get blown up. The Ryan is pink. He's so low. Oh, the Ryan's gonna get the pin. He's gonna cancel it. Long Branch needs. To hold, they need to stabilize, they need to live through this. Oh no, that's that's gonna be a big loss. May provides a bunch of stalling power. September trying to do all he can to hold this point. He's gonna shatter the mercy. He's trying to clean up all he can to hold this point. Wow, that was a fantastic hold right there from Long Branch. Er, from Long Branch. September Shatter. Oh, Reinhardt's low! Oh, they keep Mob Squid. Mob Squid's not be able to survive. He's shattered. Or he's, uh, September is nanoed. That's a couple losses on the side of Long Branch. And oh no, C36 is back up and too much pressure. Madawan going to take King's Row. 4-3, and they're going to take the series 2-0. Play, Play the game going to Minor Co. Niner from Adewan, Kiriko. And that. What? Did, did, did this just come up? <laughs> In the chat? It just said that now we're streaming? Like, did. Oh, is it now gonna load? That's funny. Anyway. Ah, uh, whatever. I'll close it out. We'll post the video if, if the stream didn't go up anyway. Alright, so it looks like Mad One gonna be taking it two to zero. Some pretty good fights, some pretty good engagements for Long Branch. Ultimately, you know, they couldn't win it. Uh, but uh, King's Row there, like you kind of saw, like they got the fighting spirit. They they got like like some of like the tactics and the plays to uh, to kind of like to win it. But you know, Madawan being undefeated right now, just you know, there's good opponents to go against. And you know, unfortunately, the better team won, and it wasn't Long Branch today. But no worries. Um, going on into the rest of the series. So one branch going to be one and three, going to be playing Rowerton High School next week. So uh, be sure to tune in to that. Uh, thank you. Uh, I think the stream was online. It says we're streaming, but yeah, whatever. Like I said, we'll post it on uh, YouTube anyway. Uh, thank you for coming out and supporting Long Branch uh, Green Wave today in their Overwatch match. Be sure to uh, tune in next Thursday at 3.30 as they take on Rowerton in 
Overwatch. All right, everyone, have a good rest of your day and week.